live. We are live. All right, so today we're going to have a little bit, something a little different. It's gonna be a surprise. It's gonna be walnuts instead of pecans. So I'm gonna get that chat room open and we're gonna make sure that, yep, we are live. Pop that sucker out. So how is everybody? Yeehaw. Oh, so check this out before we get started. So Kelly's Crafting was just right there. So welcome everybody from Kelly's Crafting. So she was making something out of nothing from trash, basically. Stuff that people are gonna throw away. Or it's gonna be the best. So this is a slot car that I made. from trash and it runs on the slot car. It's a 1 32nd slot car frame. So I just used the frame and I uh, built everything on top of it and I added LEDs. This is an analog slot car, it's not digital. So everything you see here was gonna be trash that was gonna be thrown away except for the eyes. I bought the eyes, but these are Q-tips and no, they're not used. Um, and everything else was trash. So I put LEDs on the back, it lights up when it goes around the track. I'll have to feature this and uh, have that running on the stream somehow one day. But yeah, it's a running vehicle. These are lids from uh, cool, um, the uh, whipped cream kind of stuff in a can that I don't eat anymore. <laughs> so anyway, I just wanted to show you, this was made out of trash, just like basically what Kelly just made on Kelly's Crafting. So big shout out to Kelly's Crafting. All right, let's get to what we're doing here. We are working with some walnuts today and we're making a dessert. I just made this up on the fly. So we're going to pop the chat out and get it big. We're gonna do live. I made three new songs last night. And yeah, as usual, I got to bed at um, Pretty late. All right, we got a big chat now. I should be able to read that from over there. Maybe. All right, we got Thomas, we got Allie, we got G-Gab, Red Cactus, Wendy. We got um, Chris, Dennis, uh, Katie is in the chat, Stephanie, and Carol Burton, and Katie, and a beautiful day. All right, so let's do this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start measuring what we need, we're gonna do four cups. So here's what we got going on here. We're gonna have four cups of walnuts, a teaspoon, a half a teaspoon of salt, and a full teaspoon of cinnamon. Just like we did the pecan butter, but we're using walnuts. And then we're gonna make it into a dessert. So let's get that measured out real quick. And if for some reason my stream all of a sudden stops, that means my system blue screened. Uh, yesterday, 20 minutes after my live stream, my computer blue screened. So I redid a whole bunch of stuff, took a whole bunch of software off that I didn't need, made sure the drivers were up to date, all that fun stuff. And um, we're going to see if this, this computer is a little bit more stable. It was also running a little hot, so I took the, uh, the fact that my uh, machine is sitting above the kitchen. It probably got a little hot, so I opened the case up because it's sitting sideways and I have a fan kind of blowing on it. So we're going to do four cups. Yeah, we're going to do four cups of walnuts. So let's hope that we have a stable stream. If it stops, then um, I guess I should have hit the record button to record it. But we can do this some other time if this stops and it doesn't work correctly. So there's about two cups right there. So we're gonna get this going. We're gonna be doing this on solar power. This is a Black & Decker, uh, the cheapest one that they make, the least expensive one. Black & Decker right there. 
it's the one with just the regular old push buttons and the reason why i got this one is because i can run it on solar it does, there's no electronics in it it's not looking for a certain type of voltage so that's why i chose that one it's the same one that we made the pecan butter with So everybody cross your fingers that we have a lot, uh, stable stream today. There, that's four cups. That'll leave me a little bit extra. And these are just uh, plain old walnut halves. Right there, not sponsored by Fisher. Here's the other two cups. I made this song last night. And this song is called Slow Jump. All right, so there we go. We're gonna start this up. We're gonna see if we have enough sun juice. This is gonna be a little bit loud. So, um, it's gonna be really loud. So I might, uh, I might walk away from it. So we'll let's see if we have enough sun power to start this sucker. Billy says, oh boy, what are we doing today? It's in the description. It's in the title. How's it going, Nitro Freak? So yeah, we're making a dessert with walnut. We're making walnut butter right now in a food processor. This is four cups. And we're making it on sun juice. So we're using inverter power to make this. And let's get it started. We got AAP in the chat as well. Shout out to AAP, Nitro. y'all can hear me over the blending, but that's probably pretty loud. You can see it starting to work right here in the bottom. Sorry about the loud stuff here, but we're almost done. So...
All right. So that was loud. I uh, turned down the mixer there. So I don't want this to be completely blended for this dessert. I want it to be a little bit not so uh, creamy. So we got our bamboo spatulas here. And shout out to uh, everybody that just joined me in the chat and I haven't been able to catch up with you. But this is our, I made these bamboo spatulas oh, probably about four months ago. This is the bamboo spoon. And that's engraved with sunshine and a Fresnel lens. So completely organic and use the sun to make the design. So let's see what we're working with here. Yeah, that's going to be the right consistency that I'm looking for for this dessert. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to get this chilling in the deep freeze. And we're going to be using our bamboo spatula. It's exactly like I wanted it. Uh, I didn't put any salt or any, uh, you know, we could do that. I didn't put any salt and uh, cinnamon in it this time because I want to see what it's like without it because that's going to be in our, um, the salt is going to be in our chocolate mixture. So, so that's all we need right there. And I don't want to make more than what I want it. This is going to be one little dessert here. And I want it to have, I don't want it to be smooth. I want it to have little mountains on it like that. Because we're going to do something really cool here coming up next. And we're going to use sun power to do that as well. So there's our little bottom layer of just walnuts. We're going to cover this up so we don't have any garments getting in there. I'm gonna go put this in the happy little deep freeze. So red cactus, you like this? I made this last night. I started it over again because I started blending over it. So we're gonna chill this in our deep freeze. And now we're gonna go make our chocolate part portion of this dessert. Now I'm just making this up on the fly. I kind of made it up this morning. So we're gonna bring this over here to our happy little cutting board. And we need a knife and now what we're gonna do we're gonna heat up our butter and we're gonna use about this much right there maybe a little bit more that'll work and now we're gonna put some cinnamon or should we put chocolate in there Let's put chocolate. Yep. Let's change it up. On the fly, we're gonna do chocolate. Why not? And how much chocolate? We're gonna have chocolate. We're gonna add a little bit of sea salt too. And this is organic. So we got about that much, and maybe two of those. It's gonna be a little bit more chocolatey today. We're gonna to step it up a notch. And we're gonna add a little sea salt. This is gonna be our icing that's gonna go on top of our walnuts. It's gonna have a little salty action there. The butter has salt in it. It's grass-fed butter, salted. We're gonna add just a touch of cinnamon, not much. There we go, that'll modulate the blood sugar a little bit. Now we're gonna go use sun juice to heat this up. And let's see if we got enough power to do that. So we're gonna plug our happy little toaster oven in to our inverter. And we're gonna see if we have enough juice. Let's see, which inverter are we using? We're gonna use this one. So that is this one. We'll just, uh, we're going to borrow power from there, and we're going to do it just like this. We'll just see if that can handle our, the wrath. Now, when you put these things on broil, they don't use as much power, so we're going to be pulling about 600 watts, close to 650. 
we're gonna warm that up just a little bit. And it's pulling down the battery bank pretty good. We're looking at uh, what 12.9 volts. In a perfect world, it'd be floating at 13.8 or charging at 14.4, but we're okay. The sun is just kind of uh, it's kind of cloudy-ish, overcast. All right, so that's what we're working with there. That's chilling. We got Kelly in the chat. That's going to heat up, and then we're going to stir that up. We got Moon over Miami. So what am I missing in the chat? If you want to get my attention when you're chatting to me, make sure you put my full chat name in there, Fry TV all together, and I can see it in orange. So I'm going back to catch up with the chat. We've got Nitro Freak, we got Chris, we got Katie, we've got AAP, Dennis Osborne, I haven't seen him in a while. I'm starting to see him more again. So would you eat what I'm making? In the chat here let's just start a poll let me do a real quick poll here yeah we'll have the sinister music playing in the background for the poll all right so it's been a long time since I've done a poll we need to start a poll and I'll just put would you make this because if you're going to make it, you're going to eat it. This dessert. Computer, spell dessert. Dessert is spelled D-E-S-S-E-R-T. There you go. Would you make this dessert? All right, so that is our poll music. I made this last night, too. It's kind of a sinister trap that I made there, Red. Somebody's got a birthday. Let's see, who's got the birthday? Happy birthday, Janice. Is it Janice's birthday? All right, so you know how I feel about birthdays at this point. Uh, you should thank your mom. She's the one that did all your all the work. And maybe thank your dad a little bit too. He was there for a bit. So yeah, that's how I feel about birthdays. Let's go check on our happy melting action going on here with solar power. Oh, look at that. We got some sun juice now. We're at 13.3, 13.9, so the sun popped out. We are cooking with sun juice. That's warming up pretty good. Let's go get a hot pad, because that's gonna be hot. Let's see, which one do we want? We can use this one. Oh, so this is a new addition to the, uh, this was in the old studio. These are my assistants. That one's name is Ziggy. What time is it? The time is 2.57 p.m. Computer, what time is it? It's 2.57 p.m. Hey, Google, tell me a joke. How do trees access the Internet? They log in. There you go. So that was a new addition to the studio today, as well as I rearranged the uh, monitors. And like I said, my system overheated yesterday. I think that's why it blue screened. And I've took the case off the top off the case. I'm gonna be putting a fan up there. So now the monitors are not sticking out. I've been doing a lot of work, just keeping the system afloat all week and last week to do these live streams. But here's a little behind the scenes. While everything's chilling and warming, we're warming up our butter, we're chilling our, our um, walnuts. There's a little behind the scenes action right there of the studio four monitor system. This is our cutting board camera. We'll go over here and look at our overall camera, which I took a wise cam and put some uh, firmware on it. So you can hack a different firmware on your security cameras and turn them into webcams. The microphones are horrible, but the webcams are pretty decent. And that's this view right here. So that is a $25 wise cam that has a different firmware on it that I'm using. And then of course, we have a 1080p Logitech right there. Eventually I'll have a description of all the hardware I'm using in the, uh, on my channel for this setup. So yeah, happy birthday, Janice. 
Let's go check on our melting butter. Yep, I think that's about all we need. We'll give it a couple more seconds here. But we got plenty of sun juice to do this. So this made uh, walnut butter pretty good. And I could have blended it longer to, um, to get it a little bit smoother, but uh, I guess we could do that. I'll do that after the stream, because I don't know, I might like it this consistency. We're gonna go ahead and move that out of the way. We got Patriot Operator. I got an air fryer finally. I'm trying things out. Okay, the key with the air fryer is uh, learning. Uh, let me show you what what I how I learned the, the best way to learn the air fryer is don't read the directions. <laughs> so when I work with the air fryer, there's two adjustments that I only remember. I always run it at the hottest temperature. So at this one, um, I'll go ahead and plug it into grid power. We're going to put this thing in the peasant power real quick. Um, so the only thing with the air fryer is it wants to know the temperature. I always run it at 400 and it defaults to 20 minutes and I just leave it at that. And I always check it. Now, if you know, and you're going to forget about something, set your time, but you're going to have to learn this thing. Um, you can't just read the directions and cook cer certain things with it. There's techniques with it. Uh, when you're cooking home fries, like I did the other day, check out my Friday video where I did the, uh, the best home fries. Put the bacon on top and it stops them from drying out. They're really good that way. But I've had good luck with this Ninja air fryer. It's been used a ton. Had it for years now. So that's good. That's going to be really hot. That's probably a little bit more than I wanted. So we're going to uh, bring that handle around there. I'm going to grab that hot rod. You never want to set some cold glass or hot glass on anything cold can crack so we're going to set that on a little hot pad all right so we're going to close this toaster oven so it's not heating up the house anymore and we're going to get our happy little spoon and we're going to add our honey to this because that's going to be our sweetener it's going to be the madava honey let's see i made this song last night too I made three songs, and this song is called Rain Walker. Yeah, crazy names, huh? So now we're going to add a pretty good amount of this Madava honey right there. A little bit more than I would normally put in my stuff right there, because this is going to be a dessert. So this honey is some really good stuff if you've never tried it. I would recommend it. They're not sponsoring anything. It's like $11 for one of these. This cost 11 bucks at least. But it's purify, it's purity award. It has a purity award. It's been tested for 130 different contaminants. So honey is, can be very, uh, it can have some stuff in it. Just look into that. And that honey's been tested for that. All right, so let's stir up our icing that's gonna be on the top. So we have a little sea salt, we have cacao powder and butter, and madava honey, and that's grass-fed butter. This is gonna be the icing on top of our, our walnut dessert here. And you think it's gonna taste real chocolatey? It's not, it, it doesn't. Let's see, red cactus. I like the fact that you don't use a microwave. Yeah, if you look, uh, there used to be a microwave when I, I built this house in 97 before I was aware of how bad microwaves are for us. The microwave was right here. It had one of those vent hoods and everything. Uh, eventually, I stopped using it and I ended up putting the TV in the microwave, um, a little small television, and I cut a hole in the microwave door on the, the metal portion and it, the TV shined through the door and the TV was showing my security camera back in the day. It just showed one of my security cameras and then it showed the video stuff in the house. There's a little inside baseball. But yeah, I don't use a microwave because uh, for health reasons. 
they are putting radiation in our food and the way a microwave works is they uh, work on the 2.4 gigahertz frequency which is the same frequency that water resonates at that's how the technology works it's resonating the molecules of water in the food and it's not good to have that same thing going on around me I just don't want any added and yeah I know that I have a cell phone and I'm wearing a wireless camera <clears throat> but I don't want to hear it I just don't intentionally use stuff that I know I can not have to use that's why I use a toaster oven <clears throat> Yeah, you're laughing at me oh, at the TV in the microwave. All right, this is going to be really good. So I would normally have the uh, walnuts in the deep freeze a lot longer, and I would allow this to cool a little bit more. But what this this has butter and honey in it, so it's going to be really cool. So that's what we're working with there. Look at that. It's going to be so good. So let's go get our our chilled portion. I would normally leave that chilled for probably 30 minutes or longer in the deep freeze. This is just walnuts. There's no salt added, nothing. So we're gonna do this. We gotta start our fidget spinner there for our drum roll. There we go. Everybody's gotta have a fidget spinner. Is that too hot to grab? It's pretty warm. All right, so we're just gonna do this little number right here. Oh, that's gonna be good. That is not gonna be able to, that's gonna be for two people right there. That's enough for two people for sure. It's gonna be uh, hard for me not to eat all this. So I hope I have the willpower not to. So I haven't eaten today. And I know you're gonna want me to taste it, but I have to chill it again. Because this, this is gonna be a hard uh, glaze across the top. So we're gonna have to go put this back in the deep freeze. And I intentionally wanted some of the walnuts to stick through like that. So let's go put it in some better lighting and see what we're working with here. There we go. So that's walnuts with chocolate icing with sea salt, cacao, organic cacao, and a little dash of cinnamon and madaba honey. So we're gonna go put that in our deep freeze. And that would be my dessert later. At least half of it will. There we go. The reason why I'm not doing any uh, cooking on the stream today is because I have leftovers. And I'm going to be cooking this off stream. So I can keep this stream pretty short. But this is what we did yesterday, if you were watching. So that's all the butter. And then that's three of the uh, burger patties that we cooked up. If you were watching yesterday's stream, that's garlic and onion on the top. So that's probably it on the uh, dessert stream today. I'll catch up with chat real quick and we'll be easing out of the stream. We even got super salty hanging out in here. So Katie, um, Katie's working on a spoon holder I don't know what you call it but something it's gonna set on the stove that you can prop your spoons up on and um, I saw the pictures of the ones you sent me I'm really anxious to have them in the studio as well as the pocket chicken and Zed's place I won a um, he's got ant uh, can we put Zed's place, link in the chat. Kelly's link in the chat. If y'all are still in the chat, type link. So Zed, if you're in the chat, type link. Uh, Kelly, if you're in the chat, type link. Uh, Red Cactus, 
And Katie, I wish you had a channel for your stuff. All right, so there's Red Cactus's link. So if I wake up early enough, which I haven't been able to the last couple of days, I watch her sunrise streams. Uh, and if We The People is in here, I'm always hanging with We The People. And Ride Along Game. So there's Zed Place. Go check out his uh, giveaway video from, I think it was from last week, you can correct me. I won the eight ball. So the eight ball is gonna be sitting right here. Said, I, I made a place for it today. So it's gonna be sitting right here is where the eight ball is gonna sit. And that's gonna be part of the cooking stream flow. And we're gonna ask the eight ball questions and it's gonna give us answers somehow in the chat. We'll figure that one out later. All right, what else? I don't see Kelly's link. So I was watching Kelly's crafting right before this. All right, Nightbot is doing that. Super salty's putting his link in the chat. <laughs> there's there's We the People. Cool. So Red put We the People in there. So this is what we did today. We did. This was the ingredient for the most part. Um, we did. So we did four cups of walnuts. We didn't do the salt to the measurement and we didn't do the cinnamon to that. So it was basically four cups of walnuts that was the base of our dessert. And then you saw what I put in the icing to make the icing. There's Kelly. All right, so crafting and coffee with Kelly. She just put her link in there. Yeah, and Kelly, if you don't want, you can just always type a link in the chat as well. Shout out to Queenie in the chat. Awesome. So did I miss anybody? Annie S. So any other questions on what I made before we ease out of the stream? Eventually, I will have a outro video made for the stream, for the cooking stream. We're working at uh, 33 minutes right now, 34 minutes. So yeah. Man, I'm late. Yeah, baking. Well, that's why um, you can rewind it when the stream is over. The stream will be there. Uh, bake with uh, Miss Red. And you can type um, link in the chat there. Baked with Miss Red. So everybody can go check out your cooking setup. We got Carol Burton. So yeah, no questions. We're going to be signing off and easing out of the stream. Because I still need to eat work and I got work phone calls that came in right before the stream so I got a lot of stuff to do today so there we go so bake with miss red she just put her link in the chat go check her out she does some cooking streams red cactus says thanks for the stream super salty I posted some shorts so Graham's got some shorts on his channel finally. I'll have to go check that out. I'll have to go check out Nitro Freak. Nitro Freak, I still haven't had a chance to go back and watch some of your newest videos. First Amendment says, have a great day. Thank you. All right, Kelly's Crafting says, you have a great day, everyone. Yep, love you all. I need to put that in the chat. Oh, and if you haven't, please do this right here. That's a donation that I asked for is just hit that like button, share this out. If you can share this out on your social media, I would really love that. If everybody could share my cooking streams, your favorite one, and I would love to see comments under the videos because somebody mentioned the other day that I have a, a high view count for such a low comment count. So if you could suggest, um, you know, what would you make? How would you change it? Um, that kind of thing. Just any kind of comment. What you would like to see me make. Red Cactus just put Ride Along Gang in there. Appreciate that, Red Cactus. So, yeah. I would love to see more comments on the cooking videos. I would like to see your input, your suggestions. Uh, what you have red tagged and what I've done. And as you can see, today, I ate those pickles that were a year out of date. And I didn't get sick. So just in case you're wondering, uh, if you can go back and look at yesterday's stream and the pickles were dated. Uh, 
They're about a year past the sell date. So, yeah, pickles are old anyway. All right, so love you all. All right, so share it on Facebook page. Awesome. So anybody, I would really high appreciate if y'all could share this on your social media. That would be completely awesome. Just pick your favorite cooking stream of, of the last week or this week, or even this one, and uh, that would really, really make me happy. All right, so let's go out on what song here? Let's go out on something that I made last night. Right there. We'll, we'll ease out of the stream on this. Dennis Osborne. Have a good day. Yep, love you all. And who's live right now? Who can we hand the stream off to? Anybody got any ideas? Just share it to Facebook. Thank you, Red. Anybody got any ideas who's live we could just uh, hand the stream off to? Oh, you're going to have to stop doing that. I don't have an OnlyFans page. Stop doing that, Graham. That's a joke. <laughs> yeah. That's a fake page, but that, I'm going to have to take that out of Nightbot. <laughs> All right. Well, if nobody's live, I'm going to ease out because I still have a ton of work to do. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to take that down. People are giving me crap about that, that OnlyFans thing. It's just, it was just a joke. I can't post to the page. It's just a, a page. It's nothing but a page. <laughs> Not really. All right. Love you all. We'll do this again tomorrow. Tastes like boom. Adios, mofo. That's true. Yeah, 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 yeah. Check out Zed's shorts he just posted in the chat. Love you all.